begun. There's no point in talking about Linux if I can't edit my videos and record in Linux. I would say the Windows counterpart would be Sony Vegas Pro, and that's saying a lot. Kaden Live. Hi, 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 hi. And here is our massive mother load of coffee. And that being a cranky bitch, and we fishing around. Why don't you go get the trolley? Oh, I will. Vigiling for a second. Got me some big freaking guts. There's a big MF right there. Yeah. Look at that side. So far I got five. Oh, where'd he go? Ah, oh, he's disappearing into the cluster uh -huh. cluster orgy here. <laughs> What's going on? Oh well. Dad'll get him and we'll see him in Tony's tank. Oh, he's gonna look pretty in there. And here's the pond's cave I mean kitty. Meow. Here's the kitty. Meows. Good boy. I'm going to go out to retrieve the plants. I'm going to be retrieving the plants out of there, but first a quick little update. Everything's doing great. Bog filter doing good. Just growing like crazy in here. Helping to keep the water nice and clean. Look at that. Everything is doing beautiful. Not as clear of visibility today as the other day. It's okay, we'll have more clear visibility days. There's our creeping Charlie plants. Oh yeah. Now we're gonna go check and see what Dad caught. <laughs> Those are nice. Ooh, yeah. Oh, look at the tail on that guy. The tail on that bitch. That's a two inch tail. Look at him. That's a badass little guppy. He's gonna look nice in Tony Sanks. Can't wait to video his ass in there. Freaking awesome. Oh, Tony's gonna love these. Pond's done the best ever. But the male tails ain't gonna come so easy, so. 
Well, the female tails are getting as big as what the males that we're like, used to the males uh, being. Three more red tail females that I threw in with my breeders. <laughs> I want those red tails because those look nice. And you say, yeah, those are fine fish. Yeah, that that, that that in the gold and yeah, the golden color. guppy. Yeah, I got gold in there too. And with the neon coloring in it. I got the gold. I got some gold females in there. Good. These are gonna look nice in Tony's tanks. Yeah. I'm getting a lot of red tail males and I'm keeping them going and then I separated some little ones. Separated a lot of little ones. I'm hoping these tails will come. Now we're just waiting for um, Connie and Katie to come back so we can head on out. And speak good of the devil, here they are. Hey, hey, hey! The mob is back! Don't you know that democracy is Latin for mafia rule? Democracy. Hi, Katie. And there's uh, Katie. And she's looking at the fish. Katie, you always just to ask how old everything is. Hey, Katie, how old is God? We don't know. We thought maybe you might know. How old is God? I don't know. You don't know. <laughs> There's Margaret. Now it's time to get it the heck out of here. No, I'm going out. We're heading over to Ocean Design Aquarium on Addison in Chicago. <laughs> and here we go. And we are here at Ocean Design Aquarium. We are here. We are the Fish Hadians coming back from what you consider to be your future to give you fish. Uh, okay. <laughs> Careful. Thank you. There we go. Ever Marcus Shiak and the Fish Indians. Okay. And here we go. <laughs> ah. Back again. We are here to stalk you and harass you with new fish. <laughs> that's, that's fine. Tony restocking the tanks. Alrighty. You're gonna love these guppies. They're gonna blow your mind. Here. Hey Tony, come here. Have you noticed the, ta the tail on that, that big MF over there? Yeah, got a big tail. <laughs> he has like a two inch tail, you see yeah. that? Mm -hmm. That's huge. Yeah, one well, does have a really big tail. Yeah, yeah. that's the way that's we're the getting way them. That's eventually the way and, I want them all to be. And you know what? We're getting the female tails to be as big as what, as yeah. what you're used they to the males the looking and, like. Uh, a little oh yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, Tom. because the bigger Tom. they're great. Yeah, the bigger we get the females, the bigger their tails. So their tails yeah. are starting to get we, the same way you're used to seeing the males. We shut down we got it all built up with uh, the little stinger buddies. Right. And then we uh, opened it up, and it all went in the Give me one second. Sure. Yeah. Okay. okay. Not a problem. Yep. When we threw the goldfish and the guppies in, they cleaned it up. Cool. Beautiful. Wow. I mean, they were eating it like crazy. Uh huh. Yeah. Like they're putting they our were Charlie starving. plants in there. And then plus they got lots of mosquito learning. Oh, oh yeah, that freaking bog filter. You know, you have it off for for a week or two. And you got all the mosquito larvae and fly larvae and things like that that lay all kinds of eggs in there and it hatches. Yeah. We even had blood worms. <laughs> yeah. 
Oh yeah, so I mean, there's all, you, you let that grow a bit so it's a bigger meal for the fish. And then you turn the bog filter back on and all that gets flushed into the pond. Hey, that's just too sloppy. That's a shame, that's a nice fish but too sloppy. Oh, that one? She can hardly swim. Yeah, that's not one of ours. No. Yeah, nice, but she got something wrong with her on the swimming bladder. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, that reminds me. The fish that we're giving you, the guppies, six months old, roughly. We, yeah. we just get them that big that fast because the pond has that benefit. Oh, it's unbelievable. Six yeah. months. If you, need, uh, if you need females, I could sell you another 60 easy. Oh, females? Fancy females. Oh, yeah, we got more females than males. Oh, my God. So, like, let's say you wanted some big cow females <laughs> to put in with these boys here to make it a more attractive oh, display. We can do that. Yeah, if, we, if I put them in there, they would get sick. Because those are imports, so those are used to being around parasites and stuff. They, I guarantee they're around parasites that these aren't. Right, right. And, and they just the, the put them in there and don't get the parasite. No kidding. Yeah. I really that's what's know really, that. That's what makes it hard when people bring me fish. They really have to go in a separate tank. Yeah, I see I what put you mean. Yeah. The fish that are from no the wholesaler. Kidding. You mean there's nothing you can put in the water that'll... Well, no, you're never going to kill all the bugs. You know, even 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 your so now if people have some kind of parasites in right so things, you yeah. mean if people buy these fish and put them in a tank for their regular fish there's a chance of well they have fish from everywhere though but see when you're when you're raising fish and that's all you have is the fish that you raise right those fish are not around yeah. you know what I'm saying right but not, most yeah. people are buying fish from all over so they have fish with you know there's different things yeah that. But there's but there's one thing in the pond. Yeah, there's one thing you're not taking into Wild. account though. Ours are, are infinitely stronger than any of these. They got a really good immune system. They can take a beating. You know what our, our guppies and our swords can do and we've done this. We've had it to where as we were um, you know pulling everything out for a few days, the weather got real cold. The water was 40 degrees. They were fine. The guppies and the sword tails were fine. They yeah. were in there like that for a few days as we were getting them out. They were tough. No fatalities. Nope. We well, just had to be careful yeah. with acclimating yeah. them from the yeah. colder to the warmer. It took a while. No, yeah. That's a strong. But yeah, so I don't really think you're going to have a problem putting them in here because their immune systems. But why oh, I'm chance, full, but yeah. Chances? Yeah, that's up to why Tony. Chances? I wouldn't take the chance. No, why chances? Because then once they get sick, then everybody gets sick, and then I lose yeah. the whole time. Right, no, you don't it's need It's not that. worth taking the chance. Yeah. 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 Make your money. <laughs> These are from overseas, too, aren't they? No. no that's all, local, all that's locally bred by a guy. Really? Well, well, then the, well, then the females are worth getting if it's local. He breeds those in his house, too. They're not bred outside. They're bred inside, but he doesn't. They, they come up pretty nice. Nice. It is. Huh? I, I think that I think uh, that that's a good genetic refresher, then, Dan. Because if they're bred here, then there's nothing screwy with them. Female black-tailed swords. Wow. Look at that. They got some red ones in there too, and some. I like I like the males. He's got some nice males in there. Yeah. I really, I really like the males. So 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 the that's a gold dust molly though. That's well, not a that's not a sword. He did no, breed those. No, I'm saying I like the so I like I the sword. The, the yeah. Gold dust are bred too. Dad, we were we were looking for a good molly stock. Remember, because the molly stocks that we've seen suck. Well, molly. If these did, are home bred. Did you know that swords are brackish? I did not know that. No. Yeah, I was reading an article, and it, um, it said in the wild that they're in a more salty habitat. Wow. Yeah, I was reading it on the, online. Yeah, we but didn't know I that. I think either. the swords now have been acclimated, you know. The, the yeah. ones we have, not the wild ones, but the yeah. ones. Right. They're a little different. Yeah, they got nice big tails. Yeah, I picked the best that we have. Special for you, Tony. I've had a bigger, that biggest one we put in there, Tony, I've had it bigger than that. Have you? Twice that. Look at that monster. I used to belong to a guppy, a guppy club years ago. And we used to put them in there. That's the biggest I could get so far. Oh, they're getting bigger and bigger all the time. Look at that bad boy. 
Look at the tail on that bitch. Look at the tail on that bitch. That is huge. Look at the tail. Fish over the winter? Or? No. You don't leave anything over no. the winter? No. But uh, if our winter starts getting warmer, we're going to be able to raise the goldfish in there over the winter. And it looks like it's starting to happen. I mean, if it's cold, you could leave them in there, that's for sure. Yeah. Because that's six feet deep, so it won't freeze.